Hi, this is Ike from Groovy Entertainment. Today video is talking about Pinocchio. And I did I played these two books on records yesterday, uncut. They got to hear everything that that was on the record. Because I when I had played these things a long time ago, I had to edit out the song on this one because two years ago. Uh, Wish Upon a Wish Upon a Star got banned, and when it got banned, it banned the whole video. So I had to cut that song out, and it was still copyrighted, but that song wouldn't have been. Then I did it for the first time this year, and the, the whole video went through. Didn't he still own the right to this video, to this record? So I don't make any money off this off this video at all. It goes straight to Walt Disney, and. This one, the same reason, or uh, the same reason, I had to cut out one upon a star to get the video up there. And this, and then that's why you got a cut version and an uncut version. The cut version can make money off of the cut, uncut, I can't make a dime. So, what you see up there now that I put up yesterday, did, um, why didn't he get the money for this one too? So, they're making double money off of me. <laughs> Now, Pinocchio, I seen on TV back in the 80s and 90s. I saw it on uh, War Diddy Presents here on ABC or NBC. When they showed this one, Alice in Wonderland, uh, Sleeping Beauty, and Snow White. Then with, the, with the four pictures they showed that night, it was a Sunday. And they showed four great pictures and Bambi. So I got to see it that way. I don't know how uncut it was because I was on the regular TV with a TV antenna. And then I saw it on a VCR tape in the 90s. And then I saw it for the first time, uncut, clear as can be, on a DVD from Netflix about two years ago when I was in my 30s. So, okay, probably four years. Got back 37 when I saw the movie Uncut. Players can be. And it was an okay film. It wasn't the best movie. Now, both books are different. This book talks about the beginning. It talks about where he goes to become a donkey and when he fights the will. And this one got all the original voices in there. So like you're watching the movie in record format. Show sure, some pictures. I don't want to break the record because it's the only copy I have. Let's see. I'm not going to show you the whole book. Eh, here we go. Now you might hear the dog bark a little in this, in this video. So it looks like this. You get to see the beginning of how the picture was made. And then you see the blue fairy. Yep, there goes the dog barking. And then they go to the donkeys. They don't do the school when you're supposed to go to school at all. And they had to read the voice. So I'm glad for that. And if you're watching this video, we're going to have an unboxing episode after I get done making this video. We got more of the donkey scenes. I think the only good part about this was the donkey scene in the well scene. The whole movie itself wasn't that great. Then they fight a well. Now, this came out in 1940. This, I think, yeah, the same year Fantasia came out. I'm going to go with the dog again. And this movie didn't make any money. This this movie failed at the box office back in 1940, as 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 I read. Now the next Pinocchio book is the same, but you got a lady doing all the voices. I don't want to mess the record up because it's the only copy I have. Now this is the 1966 version. That one was the 77. The same, not the same book, but the 66 kind of version of it. You got the Blue Fairy. 
Now, if you watch my main channel, Groovy Entertainment One, I think it's called, or whatever, I read about about five or six different books of this movie that you can see on that channel also. Now, this book talks about these two these two people. And this one, he does go to school in a sense. Let's see. But the donkey scene ain't raised. Okay, the donkey scene is big in this one. But the whale scene is gone. So I don't know why they cut out the whale scene in this book. They talk about it, they don't show it. Let's see, yeah. This is as much as you get from the whale scene. He goes back home, gets the letter. Telling telling him about his about his father getting looking out for him and getting chap and all that. But they talk about the whole scene, but don't show it at all. And that's the end of the book. There's nothing there. So if you would buy these these things, if you could find them, I would get this one. Now there is a book on tape that I saw. And I did do a Offshoot of or uh, not the Walt Disney version, but a but uh, European version. I'm not too sure how that book came out because I can't remember it, and I don't have it next to me to, to play with it to show you what it looked like. I don't know if that one was the Walt Disney kind of way or the original Pinocchio way. If you remember that Peter Pan Pinocchio book that I had, then it was a two part episode. Leave it in the comments, and if you know any other Pinocchio stories on audio that you would like me to play, leave it, in the, leave it in the comments and I might try to look for it because these things are these things are easy to find. But most things that most things are hard to find because I play retro stuff and retro is not cheap and not easy to find anymore. Now that I'm looking all like in this case, this book is almost 50 years old. So, year old property is hard to find. This is only forty something years old. And if you've seen any of these movies at the theater way back in nineteen forty, leave it in the comments also. Are on, are on TV the way I've seen them. So, please like, subscribe, share, and comment. Have a groovy day with another video coming out real soon.